One afternoon, Tom went outside to play. Come with me, Grandma, he said. Me, Grandma replied, I'm too old for that. No, you're not, Tom insisted. The sun cast gentle shadows in the garden. A twig snapped, and an apple fell to the ground. Who's there? Tom asked. Only the wind brushing through the trees answered. Tom looked around, and the tall grass seemed as though it had been flattened, as if someone had walked through it. Following these footprints, Tom reached the small cottage where his grandma used to live. Tom had never been inside this cottage, but now he thought there might be some treasures hidden within. He pushed the door open. A faint light seeps through the window, revealing the cluttered interior. Tom started searching, in the old drawers, behind the mirror, and inside the rusty toolbox. In the back corner of the cottage, Tom found a tall closet, and he opened the door. It was a stuffed bunny. Tom gently picked up the treasure. Sitting on the damp grass outside, Tom held the bunny and closed his eyes to take a break. Suddenly, he felt a light tap on his shoulder. Hi, Tom said, who are you? This is Grandma's garden. It's my garden too, the girl replied, I came for the stuffed bunny. But I found it, Tom said. I know, she said, but it's mine. Tom looked at the little girl. Let's play together, he suggested. They played with the bunny. They played games of spies and giants. They played statues and hide and seek. Look at those roses over there. I planted them because my name is Rose. Grandma's name is Rose too, Tom said. As darkness fell, Rose said, I have to go. I'll be with you forever. Now, there was no one left in the garden. After playing for so long, Tom felt a bit tired. He sat down, closed his eyes, and rested for a moment. Tom, he suddenly heard Grandma calling. He rushed back into the house and held his Grandma tightly. I love you, Grandma, he said.